Are you looking for the best Mini ITX motherboards? In this video we will discuss about best Mini ITX motherboards which are best sold and achieved top rated reviews from customers. Before we get started with our video. We have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. Asus ROG Strix Z690i Gaming. If you're planning on building a high-end gaming computer and you want to have the option to overclock your processor, then your best option right now is either this Asus ROG Strix Z690i or the X70e I listed below, depending on whether or not you want an Intel or AMD-based system. At just under $400, the Z690i is currently one of the more expensive LGA 1700 Mini ITX motherboards available. The Z690i features dual M.2 ports, the slots have a heatsink, USB 3.2, Asus Azor sync RGB lighting, and RGB headers, and support for up to 64GB of DDR5 memory with a clock rate potential of as high as 6400MHz, with overclocking. It also comes with plenty of ASUS-specific features and settings as well, including Game First 6 and Fan Expert 4. Ultimately, if you have a large budget and are looking for the best Mini ITX motherboard to build a small form factor Intel-based system with, then the ASUS ROG Strix Z690i is probably your best option right now. Although, that will soon change when Intel releases their 13th Gen CPUs. Number 2. Asus ROG Strix X670EI Gaming While there aren't a ton of Mini ITX motherboard options currently available for AMD's brand new AM5 socket, of the options that are out there, the Asus ROG Strix X670EI Gaming is probably the best. Yes, there are a lot of Asus ROG Strix Mini ITX motherboards on this list. But, it's for good reason. For many ITX motherboards, Asus ROG Strix series generally has the most robust designs and feature sets, offers the best overclocking potential, and, generally, comes in at very competitive price points. And, the same is true for their new X670 chipset ITX motherboard. This Asus Mini ITX motherboard can hold up to 64GB of DDR5 memory, offers dual M.2 ports, features PCA 5.0, and comes with a 10 plus 2 power phase design to allow for decent overclocking potential. Ultimately, Asus ROG Strix X670EI is the top AM5 Mini ITX motherboard currently available. So, if you're looking to build a new high-end AMD Zen for based mini gaming PC, this is probably the motherboard for you. Number 3. Gigabyte X570i Ares Pro. AMD just released their new Zen 4 lineup of CPUs and, in doing so, introduced their new AM5 socket. That means that AMD's Zen 3 CPUs are the last processors to work with the older AM4 socket. So, if you're building a new gaming PC, it is understandable that you'd be discouraged on building on an older socket that has no generational upgrade opportunities. However, if you don't have an unlimited budget to work with, the AM4 socket is still a viable platform to work with. AMD's AM5 socket is far more expensive to build on. The new CPUs are far more expensive, the motherboards are more expensive, and the DDR5 memory is more expensive. So, if you are working with a tighter budget and you want to moderate your spending to that you can allocate more money towards your GPU, then building a mini ITX PC with a Zen 3 CPU and an X570 chipset motherboard is a solid alternative. And, of the X570 mini ITX motherboards out there, Gigabyte's Aorus Pro is a solid feature-rich choice that will accommodate overclocking. Coming in at just under $2.30, it is nearly $1.50 cheaper than our pick for the best X670 chipset. That, right there, is already enough to bump up one or two GPU tiers. In the end, AMD's AM4 socket is still a solid option for gamers who are working with a more restricted budget. And, while there are a ton of mini ITX motherboards available for Zen 3 CPUs, Gigabyte's Aorus Pro is easily one of the better options. Number 4. Asus ROG Strix B660i Gaming If you want to build a mini PC with an Intel 12th generation processor, but you're not looking to hit extreme overclocks, or you don't want to spend the premium for a Z690 chipset board, then you have a few options, a B660, H670, or H610 chipset board. 
For those of you with a moderate budget, either a B660 or H670 Mini ITX chipset board will work. And, for the B660 chipset, again, we give the nod to Asus ROG Strix Edition board. This is a DDR5 motherboard that can hold up to 64GB of memory, features two M.2 ports, one with an onboard heatsink, and offers Asus AuraSync RGB lighting software. On the other hand, if you want to save even more money, the H670 or H610 chipset motherboards below have lower price tags and will allow you to pay less for memory, as they are DDR4 motherboards. Number 5. Oshrock H670M IDX slash AX. With the successive launches of Intel's 12th generation CPUs and AMD Zen 4 CPUs, DDR5 technology is now the de facto choice for anyone building a high end gaming PC. However, DDR5 memory currently comes with a steep premium. And if you don't have a huge budget to accommodate it, it might not be the best option for you. This is especially true if your main purpose is to play games. While DDR5 will provide a small performance boost over DDR4 in gaming, the money saved by opting for a DDR4-based system could give you enough to jump up in GPU tiers and that will provide a significant boost in in-game performance. And, of the Intel 12th Gen DDR4 motherboards out there, Ashrock's H670M ITX slash AX or Asus H610i Plus are probably the best options. However, the Oshrock H670M ITX slash Axe is a better choice for those of you that have a more moderate budget. There's nothing too fancy about the Oshrock's H670M ITX slash AX. It supports up to 64GB of RAM, has two M.2 ports, comes with an M.2 heatsink, and features PCI 5.0 technology. But, it will give you everything you need to build a mid-range, or slightly better, mini ITX gaming PC without costing you a ton of money. Number 6. Oshrock B550M IDX slash AC. If you've decided to save some money and build your new PC on the older AM4 socket with a Zen 3 CPU, but you don't want to spend the premium to get an X570 chipset motherboard, or you don't have plans to overclock your system, you can save money by opting for a B550 chipset motherboard. Oshrock's B550M IDX slash AC is a solid option that comes with a more affordable price tag. At just under $1.75, the B550M ITX slash AC will give you everything you need to build a powerful AMD-based mini gaming PC. Like all of the other motherboards on this list, the B550M ITX slash AC will allow you to install up to 64GB of RAM and has multiple M.2 ports. Other than that, it is a pretty standard motherboard. But, if you're looking to save a little bit of money on an AMD Mini ITX build, it's the perfect option. Number 7. Asus Prime H610i Plus. Building a budget-friendly Mini ITX PC that has newer hardware in it is a tough task. That's because Mini ITX components typically come with a premium. And, as a result, there really aren't any truly budget-friendly Mini ITX motherboards. Or, at least not with the current generation of hardware. You could opt to build with older generation components. But, if you want to stick to newer hardware, the cheapest Mini ITX motherboard option right now is Asus Prime H610i Plus. This is a bare-bones Mini ITX motherboard that is suited for a CPU like the Intel Core i5-12400 or i3-12100, or the Ref variants. And, while it still costs over $100, you will not find a cheaper option currently available. The bottom line is that, if you're looking to build as cheap of a 12th gen Intel-based Mini ITX gaming PC as possible, then this is the motherboard for you.